how I begin thinking about a show is uh, is complicated. I mean, it's like it's this is vague, sh you know, show that I have to do, and suddenly it's like I'm, I begin to remember. Yes, I've been to Buffalo. Uh, mm, they have great Pollock in Buffalo. Uh, the show is their, their collection is very em emotional and. <laughs> It's very blue and orange, and I went to Niagara Falls. You know, it's like a composite and a collage in that way of lots of things that I've remembered about Buffalo or think about. And there's, at the t for the last couple of years, sort of an image that I have used because of its uh, the nature, just the nature of water and all of all of what that means in terms of like it's buoyant and it's strange world where things float and slide in on each other, and that the gravity and the whole texture of uh, the whole thing is not like uh, you know, the atmosphere uh, above, above the ground. But um, then that began to be part of th this show, like there will be orange in the show, like I remember. And then as you proceed, like things again start to overlay and pick up, and that either will Either I will do those things like I thought I would do, or it becomes something else. But at least that's why I move into the piece with it, these sort of set ideas about uh, abstraction. You know, there's a lot of other references in the work. I'm, I feel like a warrior for abstraction because hardest, it's, it's like the hardest thing for people to really believe is, is real. I mean, it's very, in, in terms of painting, it's mm -hmm. like, it's, uh, and with the turn of the century, that, that I think that's what made this century like fabulous. Is it, it gave weight and credence to sort of like that I, ideas can be understood and things can be felt in, without having apple and you know person and tree. You know, so uh, yeah, so my heroes are are you know all you know <laughs> Pollock and uh, you know all, everything that's upstairs. That's like. It's almost like my my champion, champions, or mm -hmm. you know, and and every time I look at them and they seem so viable and so alive, it dawns on me that it it and it's and it's open. I see them differently now than when I did when I saw them, you know, years ago. Mm -hmm. And it's not that figuration is not that. It's just that I just get it and I know that that's a valuable place. Usually when I begin, it's like I, I begin cold, cold. Uh, and then I go shopping, <laughs> and I buy a lot of material, and uh, and it starts out really very slowly. I start making a form that, and then maybe make five or how to paint it, or and I, I don't really touch that process very much. I don't sort of intervene very much, uh, and naturally it will develop. Does the scale Almost of those well. relate to the scale? Yeah, sequence? sure. That that will. Um, yeah, if it's a very, very large space, I'll try mm -hmm. to think in larger gestures. Sometimes not even, in the beginning, it might even just be like working out of material, black plastic in than I've ever mm -hmm. used. This place was closing out all of this material. And I've used plexiglass before, but w in rummaging through the stacks, they had these very transparent blues and very transparent oranges and some very highly saturated colors, which are sort of hard to find, at least in in the thickness that I use. And, and the transparency implicit with that was, it also was sort of clean and sort of ma manufactured. And it was something I would, it's not, I'm not at this point, it's, this, that's not really functioning. But what I thought would happen is this show would have a lot of transparency areas mm -hmm. and like the plexiglass over, so you really would lose much even more it was how it was functioning and that plexiglass would sort of almost like uh, it does it, depending on how it's <coughs> excuse me on the wall it either acts as a mirror or you see through it or it, it bounces something around and the light hits on it obviously f faster and and slides mm -hmm. uh, this has more metal it's there are a lot of welded elements so suddenly not only does the what's possible with that uh, but it, you have sort of teaching yourself again. And I've noticed that the welded elements uh, really harken back to stuff which wasn't welded. But it's almost like it, it's like you can only do one thing new at a time and you bring back. 
you know, so they really hearken back to other, other forms and other shows. But, uh, so, and with each show, that's what I try to do is like add something new, at least that pushes this in some way in, uh, structurally to another place, someplace mm -hmm. else, whether it looks that way. They tend to sort of certainly look like I did them. I think my work comes at you, a lot of paintings are. I think that, that heightened color sort of, it's, it's really, it's like, it's like a flip book. It really comes very fast. Mm -hmm. And I think we're capable now of sort of getting a lot of images and getting it all and assimilating what it all means, whether you know specifically what it means or not. Because know. of the structure. Because of the structure. Media. And, and, and th that color speed, the color was dropped. I think you could very s slowly sort of meander. Where this is almost like, a, you know, there's a, you hear a sound over your shoulder and you, you see a person that you remember over here. I mean, it's like it's 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 very it's it's a it ricochets. Mm -hmm. It makes you really take in uh, kind of like all at once. Uh, and I think it's the color that does that. I think uh, a lot and the structuring, but mm -hmm. it it pushes it up into another kind of speed of mm -hmm. seeing. Yeah. Do you think most viewers perceive the work in the way? you intend it to be perceived? No. no. And I'm getting so I don't mind playing, <laughs> you know. Um, no, it, mostly it's sort of seen as, uh, you know, really playful, really buoyant, or uh, and sometimes very aggressive. And, and it is, I think, uh, aggressive in, in a way. But I, I think it's mostly seen as, like, just all that stuff. And, you know, sometimes it interests people, sometimes it doesn't. But there's, there, there's it's not seen in terms of the decision making or how it's structured or what that could possibly look like a, a rehashing. I hope not because it doesn't mm -hmm. feel that way. And except for like the blocks and a few other elements, everything is brand new for this show. Look at like that, the whole language from like the last two years in one situation and will it, can it work?